York Pops are turning 30, and on April 29th, they're throwing themselves a big birthday bash featuring Laura Osnes, Will Chase, Anthony Warlow, Betsy Wolf, and many, many more. We're here to drop in on this esteemed group in rehearsal, hear what they're singing, and find out more about this evening of song. What are we doing here today? What's going on? Well, we are rehearsing for the um, 30th annual birthday gala for the New York Pops. And so a couple of us that are performing have gotten together and we are just kind of singing through our material. We are very excited and, and very fortunate to have so many great friends of the New York Pops. And they love to come to Carnegie Hall and perform with a 70-piece orchestra. I know we always do interviews and say, oh my God, this is a dream come true. But truthfully, for years, I've been wanting to join them and step on the stage with them at Carnegie Hall. Whose songs are we going to hear? Sure, I am singing People from Funny Girl, which is an epic song. This event has such an all-star lineup, such a crazy roster. Is there someone you're so excited to see performing live with you in the well, Will Chase. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Look, uh, you're right, there are so many incredible people on, on the stage. And, um, you know, uh, Kelly O'Hara will be there, and um, Rob, Rob McClure, who I actually saw in Chaplin and met him afterwards, and he's a, a great guy. I mean, I'm geeking out right now because Anthony Warlow's right there, but he's he's going to sing Rosabella. And uh, Laura Osnes has given us people, people who need. Um, who else is? What, who, um, that's all I have. That's all I have. That's that doesn't sound like Laura Osnes at all. What is the theme? Whose songs are you guys singing? Well, I'm, I'm uh, getting to do uh, Frank Lester music. I'm singing Fugue for Ten Horns from Guys and Dolls, which I was in the last revival. So it's a great return to that music and to musical comedy. And uh, I love old school musical theater, so to get to touch base with this again is it's such a treat. And to sing it with Max von Essen and Will Chase, my buddies, it's awesome. these works what's so enduring about these people well, well for me particularly with with uh, Frank Lesser my relationship there goes back to my first commercial musical ever which was 1986 and I played Sky Masterson in Guys and Dolls so hearing the boys do the Fugue for Tin Horns is pretty special to hear. I feel like one of the luckiest guys in the world because I have this job that I really love and I get to work with great people and some of the best talent in the world.